War Cry with Drew and Noah. So last week our Braves ended their season with a loss to the Pepperell Dragons. The final score was 27-7. Our Braves fought hard all season and showed the true pride that our Braves are known for. We made it to the playoffs and did very well playing in our region. This was the last game our seniors were able to suit up in the mar maroon and gray. Thank you seniors for all your great things you did as your time as a Brave. Even though Thanksgiving isn't even quite here yet, we all know Christmas is right around the corner. In celebration of Christmas time, we've got three Christmas parades coming up soon. Third County Parade is December 6th at 6, and both the Ephesus and Central Ratchet Parades are December 7th at 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Next, we have meme review, the weather, and some thoughts on what everyone is most thankful for this Thanksgiving. Enjoy. Welcome to Speed Review. Uh, today we're going to be looking at Thanksgiving related memes in a quick fashion. And Jacob is stealing my lines again. I've told him about this repeatedly and I'm about to smack him. Well, you know what? I'm a little bit too fast for you. They don't call me Jacob Speed His Pants for nothing. Let's get started with uh, this one. It's relatable. Three out of ten. Now oh man, that's, that's a good one for obese people. And grandmas in particular. Definitely going to give that a zero. This one gets a three. Uh, no, it gets a negative three. That's awful. When oof fill up on snacks and then they bring out turkey and stuffing, that, no, one and a half out of ten. We are coming on to the final two. And we still can't read them. Yeah, I, I don't think the tele... Oh, now that, now that. That's yeah. hilarious. Yeah. 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 Speed review. Yeah. Hello, Herd County. It's your local the man, Jacob Cash, with the for this week. Now, as you can see behind me, uh, it's going to be pretty gloomy this week. Uh, Monday, we'll have some, it'll be mostly sunny. Tuesday, we're going to have some showers in the p.m. Wednesday, more showers. Thursday, will be partly cloudy, and Friday, we will have even more showers. Highs for this week will be in the mid to low 60s range, and lows will be in the high to mid 40s range. It's going to be staying pretty frosty. Uh, thank you, that's all. I'm Mark Bowen, and I just want to say that I'm fa thankful for my family and friends. I'm Riley Walker, I'm happy for what God has given me, friends and family. I'm Marco Chang, and here I am, I'm thankful for my mother. Uh, I'm Jacob Vincent, and I'd like to uh, say I'm thankful for my friends and family. I'm thankful for my friends and family, that's it. <laughs> I'm Presley and I'm thankful for my friends and family and everything that they do for me. I'm thankful for my mom and dog. <laughs> I'm thankful for my friends and family here in Heard County High School. Hey Drew, what are you most thankful for? I'm most thankful for um, my family and friends, especially my family um, and all they do for me, um, my, my great parents and all they give me and the support they give me, um, especially my mom. Um, everybody, if you know me, you know how close I am with my mom. Um, just so, so thankful for everything she does and um, the beautiful and sweet person she is. So thank you, Mom. I love you. Noah, what are you thankful for? I'm thankful for everything that anyone's ever given me. Um, I'm thankful most for my closest friends. Um, I'm on the drum line. I'm close, um, I'm close with my parents as well. I'm very thankful for, um, for my mom and how long I've been able to stay with her and how much she's done for me. I'm very thankful to live in uh, this great nation, and I'm very thankful for everything God's given me. Um, I'm thankful for a lot of things. Um, my family, my wife, my dogs, um, loving what I do, the kids that I get to teach and coach, um, being a part of some amazing coaching staffs with some of my best friends. Uh, I'm pretty blessed, and I'm, I'm definitely thankful for a lot. Um, well, I'm thankful for my family and friends, obviously being healthy, um, and I'm thankful to be a Heard County Brave. I'm truly thankful for all the students here at the high school. I'm thankful for uh, my family and uh, friends, and uh, that's my home family and my work family.
So I'm here with Mr. Tisdale, and since it's at the end of sem the semester, we're going to talk about wrapping it up. So what can you tell us about that? Well, obviously we have uh, Thanksgiving break starting next week, so super excited about that. Chance to see family and friends eat some daggum good food. Uh, when we get back from break, we basically have three weeks of school left. So we'll be getting into the, the end of course milestones, uh, end of pathway assessments for CTAE. Um, and then obviously some of you guys will be making a mad dash to make it work um, so that you pass. But that's really, from a school perspective, that's what we're doing, just getting ready to do grades and uh, in that last push before all the, the EOCs. All right, so what are your plans for next semester and all the changes being made? So I am uh, moving to the county office, um, Assistant Superintendent of Student Services, um, which is a new role for me. Um, wasn't really something I was looking for, but um, you know, Mr. K, I trust his leadership and he says that he thinks that I'm the guy for it. Um, so um, I will be in charge of maintenance of facilities, operations, uh, transportation, I'll still be doing CTAE. Um, and basically I'll just be the guy that, that uh, goes around and makes sure our system from a maintenance uh, perspective is, is operating. I'll still be in, out of the, in and out of the high school, so I'll still get to see you guys. Um, but I am, I am truly going to miss being with you guys every day. So. So you guys make sure that you tune in and now back to you guys. See you guys. Thanks guys. Basketball has games this week. Varsity girls play Monday and Tuesday in the Harvest Hoops Classic at Trinity Christian at 1230. JB boys also play on Tuesday at home versus Central at 6. Also, the Terry Harper State Farm Insurance Office in Franklin will be accepting your Toys for Tots donations at their office for the holidays now through December 6th. The theme for this year's prom night is masquerade, so be sure to bring your masks. And before we go, we've got a segment we like to call Baseball Quotes with Dale and Drew. Hope y'all enjoy. Welcome back to Baseball Quotes with John Smoltz and Bobby Cox. Bobby, what's the quote of the week? Well, back in my day coaching the Atlanta Braves, Hank Aaron told me a very funny quote one time, and here's what he said. Well, it took me 17 years to get to 3,000 hits in baseball, and I did it in one afternoon on the golf course. Wow, what a great shot it was. Well, that's all for this week, Brave Nation. Tune in next Monday for all your weekly news and reminders. And remember, with pride, go Braves.